Please welcome the lovely Kate Beckinsdale, everybody. Kate Beckinsdale. <laughs> Did your microphone fall off? It did, it? did. They wanted to hook it onto the back of my knickers, but then when I heard you were commando... The, the back of your knickers? Is, Is that, that what they said? Well, that's, uh, that's what they meant. Well, what did they, they, they probably said... They don't ever say knickers here, do, do they, they? They don't know knickers. Is, uh, yes. This is more knickers than... Uh, <laughs> do you know what I thought when I saw these? I wonder how Jared is. Do you know Jared, the... Uh, He's a guy that lost a lot of weight by eating a lot, apparently. I don't know. It's, a, it's an American thing. I'm sorry. Yeah. No, so anyway, so they wanted to hook them into the back of my knickers, but then when you said you were going commando, I, I thought commando, I would yeah. too. So there was nothing to hook them on, so it fell out. Uh, I just... Well, never mind. Uh, <laughs> Yours is firmly wedged. Well, kind of where I would... <laughs> Let's just say it's where I would park my bicycle in an emergency. Nice. All right? Yeah. <laughs> You know, I'm very excited to meet you. I was always a huge fan, of course, of your work, but of your fa your late father's work. He was such a fantastic actor. They don't really know uh, of your of your father in America, do they? Very no, much. No, not at all. I mean, he was like this giant. He was a huge yeah, star yeah. In, in in Britain, and uh, he tragically died very young. But yeah. he was in a show uh, called Porridge, right. which I loved. Set in a fantastic in a great, prison. Yeah, yeah, and, and so you must have been very young uh, with very famous parents. That must have been. Uh, yeah, I was. I mean, you know, it was cool. Like, you know, I, I remember getting. To to meet the monkeys one time because he did a real he, he actual a, monkeys or the, no, the uh, actual the, singing monkeys you know oh the, singing the singing monkeys <laughs> come on you're, no, you're pulling my leg come on yeah. um yeah no that you know mickey dolenz and the little tiny one was the one i liked tom he, cruise he, yeah. <laughs> he, he's still working he, he is we may be coming to your town <laughs> So, yeah, so I, met, I got to meet them, and, uh, yeah, it was good. I, I remember discovering really young, like, what wasn't good about being the child of a famous parents, because I, I used to like that show, Family Fortunes, which I think here is called... Family, family Feud. Feud. Yeah, 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 it's Family Feud, but yeah. Family Fortunes it was in Britain, yeah. yeah. Yeah, and I used to sit and watch that and think, God, I'd love to go on that show, and I suddenly realised that nobody's, nobody was famous on that show, so you couldn't go on it if you had famous parents. So I got, that's when I realised oh, it wasn't all like Oh, gosh, it must have been hell. It was totally yeah. hell. <laughs> Work with me, I bet. Come on! Yeah, you know, I, that's just terribly sad. <laughs> Who used to host that the Family Feud in Britain? Who was it? Was it Bob uh, Monkhouse? Bob Monkhouse. Did yeah, with Bob Monkhouse. Who he used to go like this. Oh yes, he did. Yeah, yeah. That. No, he did. He used to go. You don't have to keep doing that. Well, uh, <laughs> actually, I I do for medical okay, reasons. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> No, and the guy that hosted it here was a guy called uh, Richard Do Richard Dawson, who used to be on Hogan's Heroes. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, And yeah. did he go, as well? He did, he kind did. of, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he used to kiss everybody on the show. Yeah. He used to go, welcome to the show, <laughs> darling. Oh, no. That's not very British. I don't think it's Bob not, Monk has No, no, he must have picked it up somewhere else, because English people don't kiss. No, and yeah. Bob Monk has had a lot of makeup. I would have come off on everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you, do you, do you, do you, do you a fan of the quiz shows? Do you watch them here? I don't watch, I don't, I don't watch any television. Do you watch television? You don't watch television? No, I mean, apart from this show, Oh, Avid stop. <laughs> two reasons why I know you're lying. One, no, and two, <laughs> this isn't really television. Come it's on. It's television, it's an experience. It is, it's, a whole, it's, it's like having a creepy guy in your house. <laughs> <laughs> it is. It is. It's like inviting a creepy foreigner into your bedroom every night. Do you know how many times that's happened to me? What? <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm sorry. The restraining order will, you know, I never mind. Uh, so tell me about the film, the, uh, what's it called again? Snow, Snow Angels. Angels. Yeah. Yeah, it's, um, it's a small independent film and it's, it's basically follows three couples in various different stages of, you know, love relationships. Are you, are you a couple with that fella there? He looks terribly young. No, 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 no. I used to be his babysitter. I was going to say, that's, he looks terribly young for... Not that Thanks I would... Thanks a lot. No! Thanks a lot. It's nice. No, I've I come meant, all the way up I here. Meant, I suffer the pants. I suffer yeah, the... Yeah, Let me tell me I'm old. No, I never said you were old. <laughs> I wore no underwear for you. Look where it got me. <laughs> the night is young. Uh, and if I can dig myself out of this hole, we'll get back to that. 
No, I didn't mean that. I just meant he seemed like a child who was prepubescent. That's right. what I meant. You yeah, know like what? I'd flatten him. Yeah. Basically. No, no, I didn't say that you would flatten him. How would you like LA? Is that nice it's for you? No, yeah, it's yeah. Do you do you live here now? I do. I do live here. I never really sort of decided to move here, but then I accidentally married one and, and just stayed. How do you accidentally marry someone? I, I'm saying that like I like I've never done it myself. No, no. Yeah. Everyone. Planning on marrying an American. I mean, it's still a bit hilarious to me that I've married an American. What are, what are the big differences in, in your house then? Does it, I mean, do, do you have you now accepted our strange American ways? Can you? Oh yes, you're one now. I am. Yes, I am an American citizen. What are we doing about the accent? Uh, I'm staying with it. Are you? Yeah. yeah. Well, I figured out that I've done everything else. I now, well, you know, I will stay and eat at the all-you-can-eat buffet until yeah. I, you know, pass out. Yeah. And, <laughs> And I, you know, I, I, I do all the other stuff. My teeth are better, you right. know, but, um... But, <laughs> but I'm staying with the accent. It's good to have a whiff of the old country, isn't it? It is nice to have a whiff of the old country. I'm Scottish-American. If, right. if you became an American, you'd be English-American. English-American. Yeah. Well, you kind of are if you marry an American. But you have to fill out all kinds of forms, don't you? Yeah. Yes, I haven't done that. It's not that hard. You can't just get... <laughs> It's not like there's like name, put it in, date of birth, put it in. No, but I thought... Are you a communist? No, you're done. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that. Who's I... best, Al Qaeda or the USA? Mm, USA. <laughs> you know, that's it. But I thought that you just married one and then you were in, and it's not the case. I think it no. used to be like that, possibly. Yeah, you know, you have to prove you're in love now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> do you really? Yeah. Did you have to do that? No, oh God, God bless you. No, no, I am. Uh, no, 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 no. I, I did. A, I went solo, as it were. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. You didn't have to describe someone else's charmers and things. Oh no, that, that's what they do. Is Just it? yeah, describe the, what their bottom looks like and everything, ah. and you go. All right, we're not really married. You've got me. <laughs> No, it's, right. Listen, it's lovely to meet you. I wish we had a little more time. Will you come back and talk to us at some point? Certainly will. It's yeah. very, very lovely to meet you. Keep back to Dale, everybody. We'll be right back. My next guest is a very beautiful young actress. She stars in, in the show Chuck, which is on uh, Monday nights on NBC. <laughs> Take a look at this. Look, if it's cool with you, could you hang out for a little while? Look, Awesome and Ellie think that I'm kind of getting lucky in here, and I wouldn't want to disappoint them. Oh, um... Uh, how long do you want me to stay? 42 minutes and 15 seconds. <laughs> Arcade Fire's first album, it's like an auditory aphrodisiac. <laughs> You're not really ready for it yet, I'll... <laughs> Please welcome Yvonne Strahovski, everybody. Yvonne Strahovski. Welcome, Yvonne. How are you? I'm good. Good. Did I get it right? Strahovski. No, Strahovski. Strahovski. Yes. Yeah, that's... Uh, was that Scottish? No. Uh, <laughs> Wow, how did you know? No, well, it's Polish. Polish? Yeah. That, but you're, your accent doesn't sound very Polish. You no, know? I'm Australian. You are, what is the deal yeah. with all the actors in Hollywood are Australians? We're good, aren't we? You're very good. We're very good. Do you have that way of talking that it sounds like a question? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we, uh, we often go up when we speak at yeah. the end of our sentences. Why is that? I, I don't know. I think it's I because know. you're from the other side of the world. And we stand upside down. Yeah, as where well. things are the normal rules don't apply. No. <laughs> also, also you've got the deadly animals in Australia. We do. Yeah, so you don't know if you're going to make it from one moment to the next. So you better ask as much as you can. That's true. The snakes. <laughs> What part of Australia are you from? Sydney. Sydney, I've been there. Yeah? It's very, yes, yes, I have. I, they've got the bridge there. Well, you know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Have you travelled around Australia? I have. I've travelled up the east coast and south. And what, up I to do... Queensland? Yes, up to Queensland. There's a Queensland in LA if you're looking for one, by the way. Is there? <laughs> Is it's there? a club. Oh. Yeah. Do you like the tra Are you an outdoorsy type? Do you like the travelling? I am. The I'm very outdoorsy. I, I do a lot of that sort of stuff. I rock climb and, and hike and camp. What do you do in L.A. then when you're here? Well, right? actually, I've, I've started horse riding. Really? In LA. Where? Yeah. Uh, just around Runyon Canyon, and, and there's a ranch at Malibu that I went to recently. Really? 
Yeah. You go riding around in horses? Yeah. Do you wear the Australian hat with the corks or the... No. I drape an Australian flag around my shoulder. That's nice. Nice. That's the way to get noticed. That's what you want. Are you having a good time on the Chuck show? The... A very good time. I love it. I get yeah. to, you know, kick a lot of butt, which is great. What'd you say? <laughs> I get to kick butt. Because like, like, if I can't understand you, there's not a chance in hell the Americans are going to... <laughs> But they understand you. They don't You've understand me. Just, that, no, they it. don't understand me. They're just very charitable, and a lot of them are baked, to be quite <laughs> honest. So, it's just, they're just used to me now. That's it. I'm just, I'm just part of it. I'm like, you know, I'm like cartoons. I'm, they're not really watching. <laughs> now, the, it's the, uh, uh, you're very good American accent. I had no idea you were an Australian until you turned up. That's do, good. Do they, t do they teach you this in Australia? Well, I, yeah, I went to drama school and I right. learned a whole bunch of accents. I even tried yours. That's once. what I was about to ask. Oh. Do you think you could do a Scottish accent? Uh, after the noon, ladies. That's how I talk in a Scottish accent. It's a little bit like that. Mother! But it's not... That's amazing. It's very good. Yeah, it's very, very good. You are to be complimented. Now, there's <laughs> another guy uh, on the uh, on the CBS uh, the CBS schedule, the the vampire detective. He's yeah. from Australia. Alex O'Loughlin. He yeah. is. His uh, his father and my mother actually know each other. They work together at a boys' school in Sydney. Really? Yeah. Did you ever date him? No, oh, Alex. Yeah. Yeah. No. Why no. not? I only just met him, and he's unavailable anyway, and he's not my style. What vampire detective? <laughs> 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 What is your style then, oh, questioning well, I, Australian I, I lady? I don't know if I should reveal this information. Oh, come on, nobody's watching. <laughs> Who, what, is, what is your style? What do you like? I don't know. I, I have a very uh, unique style. That's all I will say. <laughs> you only like one man. There, yeah, that's probably it. Yes, well, that's okay. That's good for you. <laughs> Man, you're going to enjoy the talk show circuit a lot, aren't you? Uh, it's all right. No, no, no. So you like you like riding around in the horses with the Australian flag. I do. And have you thrown yourself... And uh, You probably surf, of course. No, I don't. Why not? I, actually, I do a lot of adventurous things, but water is not one of my best friends. I'm, I'm not, not down with water. Really? Yeah. What do you do when it's thirsty time? <laughs> yes. I said thirsty time. Thirsty time. That's an interesting way to describe it. I know. It. It's, uh, I'm very high. Mm. Yeah. What's in that mug? It's thirsty time, everybody. <laughs> no, no. So what do you do then? If you don't do the water, what do you do? It's climbing up rocks. I, yeah, I, I climb rocks. And, uh, well, I, you know, I went, did the horse riding this weekend. I actually got bruised on my bottom very severely. I had Is to... that anything to do with the outdoor stuff or are you just something else? <laughs> well, the horse riding, it's the outdoor Oh, the horse thing. riding, yeah, of course. Uh, <laughs> of course. Well, listen, congratulations anyway on the Chuck Show. It's, it's a fantastic show. Very big. What's the name of the other guy who's on the show with Zach you? Zach Levi. He's very good as well. Will you yes. please pass on? He must be enormous because you're quite tall and he seems taller than he, you. Yeah, he's like that much taller than me. Who is he, like eight foot tall, that guy? We're, we're a tall car. Yeah, you're, you're and very Adam tall. And Adam Baldwin is very tall as well. Do they have to have special cameras that go up high? <laughs> No, it's funny. One of our camera guys is actually very tiny. So well, that's probably why you look up. tall, because he's looking up to you with the camera. <laughs> that's right. That'll be it. It's lovely to meet you, Yvonne. Thanks for coming you on too. the show. Yvonne Strat Stahovsky. Yvonne Strahovsky. We'll be right back. It's quite welcome, everybody. Welcome, everybody. Welcome. How are you? I'm good. Yeah, you were meant to be on the show last week, but you yes. were feeling a little sick. Are you okay I was, now? I was under the weather, yeah. Did you have the flu? I, yeah, yeah, I did. When, when you're pregnant, is that right? No, I'm, it's terrible. Uh, uh, so, yeah, you I got right lots now? of sleep. Yeah, I'm good now. Did, do you, have you got cranky since you got pregnant? Have you found yourself kind of like snapping at people and stuff? Um, sometimes I snap, and sometimes I get really sad and I cry. That's like me all the time. <laughs> <laughs> on the show. 
<laughs> on the show. Yeah, and I'm like, I hate you, man. You don't understand me. I love you. That, like that. Well, hey. I hope there's lots of love here. Oh, there's lots of love. We have nothing but love for you in this right. show. What, what about the, uh, what about the movie, The Eye? This movie looks great. Yes, it's very it, scary. Yeah. Do you um, have, like, laser eyes or something? Or eyes no, that my explode? No, character, my character's blind. Uh, and then she has a corneal transplant. Right. Which, you know, really happens. People right. get these corneal transplants. And within hours, you can see. So she gets gains that really happens? Yeah, and she wow. gains the ability to see, um, but she takes on the uh, cellular memories of her donor. So parts of your personality are in donor organs. Yeah, and so my... Um, That's creepy. It is creepy. Yeah. <laughs> so my character, um, her donor had these psychic abilities to see death before it happened. Obviously not their own. No. Right. Not yeah. <laughs> So it's a flawed ability then, you know. It's not completely 100% perfect. No, no. Right, right, right. But that, so you, you become psychic. So, you know, so you get she... your sight back and psychic at the same time. Yes, she does. Ooh, triple threat. Yes, it's very yeah. scary. And this is, um, uh, you know, a great weekend. So if anybody wants to go and snuggle up with somebody uh, at the movie theater, you'll definitely be Are you offering to snuggle frightened. up with people? Or is it... <laughs> When you watch the movie, it's so oh, it's scary. A, no, it's scary. You're like but it's, jumping. It's a remake time. of a Japanese horror movie, isn't Chinese. it? Chinese. Chinese. Yes. Did you see the original movie? Yes, I did. Is it very frightening? It is very frightening, but this this is uh, more a, frightening. A little more frightening. Do you get frightened of a movie that you've made, even though you're in it, and you know it's just like a big props guy dressed up going? Oh, like that. I still do. Really? Yeah. That's I, fantastic. I like horror movies. I do like horror movies too. Yeah. Do you like the uh, Do you like the the zombies? Do you enjoy the zombies? The zombies. So much. I like more like the the ghosts and the visions and the psychological thriller and the and the. But what about Twenty Eight Days Later when the zombies oh, could no. run? That's I mean come that on. That was a great movie. That was a great movie. That was a great movie. Yes, it was. And the zombies running. And but you know what always bothered me? Here's the thing. What? Zombies they eat human flesh, yes. right? But they don't poop. <laughs> We don't see them poop. Yeah. Uh, yes. They and can I'm be doing it. They know. could be doing it off camera. Yeah. <laughs> There's lots of things that people do off camera. I've that. heard all about that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, I, so you like the horror movies? Are you a fan of the Chinese and, and Japanese cinema? Do you go and see that? I, I, I don't. I mean, I'm not really aware of it other than The Eye, The Grudge. Um, the, the Grudge is one as yeah, well? Yeah, The Ring. The yeah. Oh, The Ring was great. That was yeah. with the little the kid with the... Ah, ah, yeah. So you, you watch the uh, the horror movies. You know, wait, wait, where are you going to have your baby? Are you going to have your baby in America or are you going off to Narnia or wherever? Uh, J uh, um, yeah. You know, Angelina Jolie Narnia. went to Africa, you know? Huh? Yeah, no. America? I'm here, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Uh, where are you from? I'm from California. Really? You have your baby in California, little California baby? Yeah, I was oh, born here. Really? Yeah. Oh, that's lovely. What do you folks do? Um, my father owns a mortgage and real estate company. Really? Yeah. And my mom helps him. Really? She runs the office and stuff. So they kind of have a little sitcom going on? Yeah, they really yeah. do. <laughs> what about uh, when you were a it's kid, like your dad was in the Air Force, though, right? Huh? Your dad was in the yes, Air Force? Yes, he was in the Air Force. Was he a pilot? He wasn't. Oh. No, he was in personnel. What does that mean? He hires pilots? That means he basically put people in their positions. Go and stand over there? Yeah. yeah. Or go to war, don't go to war. Well, he had that kind of power? Kind of. Man. Yeah, he yeah. had a tough job. That is a tough job. It only lasted like eight years. Did you follow him around? Were you stationed in different places? or Mississippi was it just... and, and Texas. Did you never pick up any accent? When you I did in Texas. Did you really? Did you but say y'all? I did. <laughs> y'all and mama and papa and stuff like that. I love that. Texas is a lovely place. It is. Wow. Very big. And they're armed. Be careful. Yeah, I know. <laughs> They are armed. They are armed. They I are. tell you, when someone cuts me off in traffic in Texas, I'm like, on you go, help yeah. me. Yeah, bye. I've got a different kind of wave in California, but in Texas, yeah. it's like the full fingers. You know? Yeah, here it's what, two you fingers? Just, 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 one, just one finger. One. Yeah. <laughs> to help point them in the direction they're headed. Of course. Anyway, it's, it's lovely that you, you came to visit. Was, uh, congratulations on your pregnancy and Thank congratulations you. on your movie. And you just look wonderful and radiant. And I hope you enjoy it and good health to you and your child. Jessica Thank Alba, you. everybody. We'll be right back.